Welcome back to the channel, YouTube World. Uh, someone that I ran into earlier in the game. Casual gameplay, by the way, of the stress test. Alliance Paladin. Um, we had met and we were going to go to Booty Bay, but I, I lost all that footage uh, somehow. Uh, honestly, it wasn't all that exciting. There was a lot of car corpse running. And I'm actually really disappointed, but what I'm going to do for this is part one. It's going to be an overview, it's going to be a quick impression of, uh, you know, what do I think of the game now that I've been playing it for a few hours. And, uh... I just have to figure out where I gotta go to get Gold Dust Exchange. Right. So, it faithfully recreates that feeling. The nostalgia accurately, including last night when I kept getting disconnected and I couldn't even connect. Ha ha ha. So, uh, remember when you used to hit H and look at your honor, you would get what you would see for today. My fat face isn't in the way. Good. Yeah, yesterday, this week, your skills. Remember how you used to have to uh, level up the different weapons. So if you had a mace and you went to swords, you would keep missing. You had to level it up just as you used it. Um, language, because, you know, you can learn other languages, apparently. No. Uh, reputation, pretty simple. Character, remember this. We would have relics for paladins, a quiver for hunter, rogues would have like a throwing knife or a gun or a bow. Uh, we would have these resistances as well. What else can I show you just quickly while I venture into the Fargo Deep Mines? Uh, sword specialization, so that was a pretty big deal. If you knew you were always going to use swords, you could use a human. Humans also had increased spirit. They had the... Uh, you know, the stealth detector, when they would do this, listen to it. You would know that for 20 seconds, a human would be able to, uh, well, basically be able to see stealth better. All those things, the auras, um, paladin, obviously, but other classes would have it too. Uh, intellect for, um, the mage. Paladins would get, you know, the little buffs, Blessing of Might, see, she gave me the uh, Mark of the Wild, increase armor by 25. I miss all those little things. I don't miss this type of graphic. Where where did that tree go? But, I mean, that just, you know, came with the territory. I, I still very much enjoyed the game. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So we're, ju we're just going to quest, just like in, uh, you have to pop the seal. And the animations and the graphics are classic. They are the original graphics, nothing untouched, and even the melee animations remain the same. You know, where the human jumps and comes down, he doesn't do that stupid golf ball swing. That was just absolutely ridiculous. Uh, I don't like the new animations. Uh, some of them I do, and some of them I don't. Uh, but, and it just, it runs smooth, so I've been playing on and off all day, uh, here and there, whenever I've had a chance to be able to play, and, uh, it's just been smooth. That's all I can really say about it. I don't know what this guy's trying to do to me. Oh. Thank you. Whatever that does. 6 to 10, 3.0. Oh. Oh, there you go. Wow, it almost recaptures the uh, the nostalgia of how friendly people were in uh, in Classic. I'll show you the menu uh, in a second with what settings you have, but right now, because I'm in a cave, I just want to let you know that this game does run better than retail, and that's because the graphics are dumbed down, and even though I do have a fairly good computer, and I can easily maintain over 100 frames a second, uh, it just, there's, there's just no lag. I, I'm not, I haven't experienced a single, d -d -d, you know, like a stutter or anything like that whatsoever. It's just been a really good experience. We seal up, then we whack him with the shovel. Look at that little shovel. Uh, we should have, uh... I wonder if we should level or uh, group up. 
I miss when the buffs lasted longer than five minutes. I mean, I gotta admit, that's kind of stupid. Uh, they should last at least a half hour. Who wants to group... Ah! Group up for... Fargo Deep Mine. Because it forces you, because there's no tagging, right, in Classic? So you gotta... Oh, chest! Sorry, I'm all excited. I'm like, ooh, chest! There's no heirlooms. You gotta take everything that you can get here. Come on. There we go. The latency's pretty decent, under 30. Well, that wouldn't have too much to do with, uh, with the WoW server. But if we look at the system really quick... These are the graphic settings. This render scale wasn't like that before. I have everything fairly jacked up. Everything maxed, crank 16, um, advanced, color depth. I cranked up the gamma by 0.2 just to make it a smidget brighter, just the littlest bit. Sound, faithfully more or less recreating how it was back in the day. There was no voice chat as far as I know. But again, certain, you know, quality of life improvements that had nothing to do really with the gameplay they've decided to keep in just kind of like your battle net friends list right you can still have that so they're gonna have things like that they just won't have things like transmog and, you know and the like so and uh yes yeah, so i'm really happy like i said this might end up being slow but i'm probably gonna run this uh, uh quite a while who wants to group up for f whoops, not fag, Fargo Deep Mine. That would have been really bad. Because I'm not trying to be funny, right? But I I've done that in the past by accident. I'm like, whoops, anybody want to go into the fag mine with me? And I'm like, yeah, that's not going to work out too well. Because it's a typo. Back when rogues only had one weapon, they didn't even have dual wielding. You actually had to learn dual wielding. Like, how insane is that? Hunters needed quiver by arrows, and they had to feed their pet and keep them happy. Uh, I'm telling you, these millennials, you know, it's a joke, but not really, uh, that have been playing Battle for Azeroth, they're in for a little picnic. Classic WoW was, uh, painful. Ah, uh, who wants to group? There we go. I don't know why that's so difficult for some people to understand. But yeah, so this game is going to be a, a blast. Uh, it's, it's pretty well polished, even just the way that it is now. I just can't wait to get out of this... Uh, this damn Fargo Deep Mine, because I'm sure people want to... Uh, to see more than just this. But unfortunately, this comes with the territory. And since I lost all my footage as well, and I'm really disappointed... Um, I guess there was a little bit of lag there. That's similar to retail, where there's that little bit of... A uh, little bit of lag. But that, I don't think it's because it's in beta, though. I just think... It was just lagging, period. Gonna run back in, just doing a quest. Like I said, this isn't terribly exciting. I am in a group of uh, five, though, so I'm hoping to... Uh... There's a lot of people. This is actually the issue that I had earlier with... Uh... My other video that I'm going to post now, after this one, part two. Um, it was just a little bit of gameplay. This is actually happening after the other video, but I had to recap and show people the beginning. You know, even like the original map, right? With nothing else. Obviously, we can't check our skills until, uh, I think it's level 10.
But yeah, I, I'm really hyped. I don't know what I'm going to do uh, come retail. Or once Classic is released officially, I mean, and it's in retail. Uh, if I can even afford WoW to begin with, people are like, oh, but... Uh, but the game is free. It's Yeah, but the subscription ain't. <laughs> and I'm pretty poor, so boo-hoo for me, but I may not be able to keep up with it. And that's just the reality of it. If my YouTube channel does better, uh, I might be able to afford to keep playing. We will have to see. But I definitely prefer the uh, melee animation of uh, this more than the new one. Gold Tooth is up. Gold Tooth. Oh, I'm gonna die here. Wow, that's old school. A couple of cobalts can kick your ass. Oh yeah, classic WoW was brutal, and I actually have half decent gear considering. I don't I ran out of mana. That little fucking piece of shit just stood there and watched me die. There's still a lot of fucktards uh, that play this game. I've noticed a lot of terribly rude people today. And it's, it's a generation thing. It's just not the same community. I mean, you can recapture the essence, the nostalgia of Classic WoW, but one thing you're not going to nail is... Uh, is the community. You're just, you're not going to do it. Actually, you know what? I'm going to put this right here in front of the chat because I, I could care less about it. I did a corpse run and I went all the way through Booty Bay. Or I tried to get to Booty Bay, but like I said earlier, I didn't make it. and Kind of sucks, but whatever. Because I wanted to showcase, again, that's what I do. I wanted to showcase more of the map, what it looked like. Uh, not just Elwyn Forest, but unfortunately, I can only go up to level 5. This isn't the beta where you can go up to level 30. So, unfortunately, it is what it is. Yeah, the main point of this, like I said, was uh, more or less the chatting. Just kind of showing you a few quick things. Uh... You know, the menu and, and all that kind of stuff. Uh, oh, again. Just keep... I don't, I don't remember back in the day it... It respawning that often. Mind you, yeah, I don't. Um, I don't know why they're getting their ass kicked. I can't even choose a specialization. And you used to have to pay to respec. I mean, there's a lot of... There's a lot of stuff that you had to do in this game that was a real pain in the frickin' ass. But, you know, I enjoyed it, and... Like I said, I don't think I'll enjoy this as much as I did 15 years ago, only because it's not the same community. The people can really uh, shape your experience with this game. And... Yeah, like I said, it's... Of course there's always going to be some nice people. That's like anywhere in life. But all in all, people are... Uh, people are prick faces. A lot more so than before. Yeah, gold dust, man. I'm gonna be here for a while. Uh, but I, I really do want to do the quest, though. That's the thing. 
And I know that it's kind of boring, but I mean, you got to do this. I mean, this shows you as well, like I said earlier, this will actually faithfully show you uh, what it's like to play the stress test. It's, it's, it's called a stress test because it tests your stress level. Because it takes an insanely long time. Do you know how long it took me to get to level 5? You don't, you don't want to know. We don't want to go there. At all. As to how long it took. I'm getting loot still for the quest. Why do they always Ah, oh, they're level 8, that's why. Oh, gold tooth. Oh, I see what's happening. I don't have a quest for him, though. Yeah. But because I am in a party... Ah. Some of this should be a little quicker. Too bad that buff only lasts five minutes. It's kind of stupid. There was a way to make it last 30 minutes before. Then they just changed it. You needed like some sort of uh You needed some sort of uh reagent to make it last 30 minutes, but then quality of life they changed it and they just made it uh 30 minutes, I believe, or an hour. I can't remember. It's hard to remember every single little change that's occurred during every single little patch and expansion that's happened, right? It's just too much. So we're hanging out outside. Yeah, we've already been here 17 minutes just running around. Little bastard. Really, all I want to do is just walk around, because this is the last day of the stress test, like I said. So, I feel like even if the gameplay is boring and I'm not really showing you a lot of the game, I still get to give you a little bit of information and I still get to have this as a, uh, a souvenir, if you will, for when, uh, you know, I can't afford to play the game anymore. And I'm like, oh, what did it look like? And I could look at old footage of, uh, you know, back in the day, uh, 15 years ago, and kind of compare it and go, oh, yeah, that's how ugly the leaves were and, you know, and stuff like that. It's a shame they didn't let us go up to, like, level 10. But it was mainly just to see how the servers are handling and... <laughs> Never understood that evade thing. It's like, I'm right here, you bastard. What exactly are you evading? That's what I don't like, though, is how dangerous the game is. Look at that. I was gonna say, is someone gonna help me out? Because not a lot of people are. Like I said, a lot of people are pricks. There's a few decent ones. Then there was Retribution, or there was all the different, yeah. And your mana took forever to come back. Everything took a long time to come back. 
You know how hard it was to even get your ground mount. Oh man, that was painful. I figure I hang out outside because um, I was in the mine a lot and they do respawn here decently. I feel like I have to ramble on a lot because otherwise there really just isn't much going on. I'm going to have to call this frickin' video the Fargo Deep Mine because it, it pretty much consumed the entire time I've been in here. And that's why I'm not really enjoying my recording of World of Warcraft uh, for this because, like I said, who wants to watch a guy run around for a half hour in a black, dark, damp mine? But like I said, I'm still curious. I can do an LFR, or a raid, in Battle for Azeroth quicker than I can do, uh, a regular, uh, frickin' uh, quest. Where's that chest? I was kind of hoping it would just grow out of the ground again magically. Do, I do miss this game, like the classic. I really do. I miss how the game was 15 years ago, when I was 25 years old. And now I'm 40. I don't miss being 25. But I miss, I miss this. It was a pretty special time. Yeah, back when you had to eat every couple fights, I remember on my Rogue, even in good gear. I was good in PvP, so no one can say, oh, learn to play almost every other fight at some point, or until I got really good gear. I had to, um... I had to eat almost every frickin' time. Well, she's a paladin, but whatever. I can't believe that we're gonna be in here longer than a half hour. And it's like, really, what is the point? I mean... I don't even know why I'm bothering. Well, mainly some of them. It's, uh, the, uh... It's the silver that you get so that I can buy better gear. But I'm stubborn, like I said, so it's not like people are forced to stay here. Oh, 
Oh, there's one up there. Oh, I remember that. That's right, give me that tiger's eye. I got the eye of the tiger. I'm trying to think of what else I can do. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to call this the Fargo Deep Mine. Because that's pretty much where I spent my entire time. Oh. 2.8, 4 to 9. 270. Ah, oh, but it's... Oh, wow, that's for a one-hander? That's for a one-hander. Okay. Let's, let's do that. Damn it. The Cobalt Hammer. I really liked playing, uh, Prot Pally. really kick some ass. Oh yeah, I gotta level up my one-handed skills, that's right. If only there was a way to play World of Warcraft where you already had a top geared character. But all you could do is battlegrounds with him. That would be kind of interesting. Guild Wars has a thing like that. Where you could play a max character but you're only able to... Uh, to do battlegrounds. You can't do... Uh, Nothing else. I always thought that was weird though with their shields, how some of them sit so far off your character. It's like, really? I could put a pumpkin between there. Can you not get it a little wee bit closer? I'm very OCD when it comes to stuff like that. It really bothers me. I know you don't watch your character like that, but... And if I watch him from here, it doesn't look too bad, or if I'm actually holding it, it actually makes better contact with my character. But it's still something I like to complain about. Too bad the tagging doesn't work. Oh, he's in my party anyways. <laughs> Telling you. It's gonna be a while. Oh! <laughs> 
in 2004, it didn't take me. Night Elf Hunter. Doesn't even have a pet, that's right, because you gotta wait till level 10 before you can even get one. I've done PvP fights where I've ran out of arrows. This is so dumb. Well, it was just kind of more realistic, I guess you could say. whole time. And all I've done is the Fargo deep mine. What a fail. But, you know, how many videos am I going to be able to make of this, right? So I figured even if I pump out just a few, I, I might as well. That's done for the candles. Just two more gold dust. Come on now. Sounds fine. I do like how active it is. I mean, where else are people going to hide, right? Get it? There's no other expansion. There's no expansion. There's nothing. That's kind of the beauty of it. One more dust. For the love of Elune and all that is holy. Could this be it right here? It is. We are done. It took a half hour. A half hour? Like, what the, you know? Whoops. Where am I going, eh? I think we're gonna go back. Turn in the quests. And we'll just see how this goes. <clears throat> As in where else I think I should go. The rendering is really nice, eh? The render distance. Unlike Days Gone. Mind you, this is a 15-year-old game, but still. Here we go. Turn this in. Oh, that's right. The old school way of getting on the roof. Yeah, yeah. I well remember met. that. Light bless you. Jasper load mine. I forget what was in there. 
Oh, that's a no oh yeah, I'm nowhere near that. That's because we can't level up. I should be like Good level eight you. by now. See you later. A bag of marbles. Six to ten. I'm gonna keep that one. I'm still gonna keep that one. Weapon smith. Open for business. Wooden mallet, two hand. Oh wow. Uh, let's see, cudgel. That one's ten to sixteen, five damage. Oh wow, that's. Big difference over that. Yeah, I'm not going to end up making those. A good one. And then the armor smith. Need help. Oh wow, look at that. Oh, that's true level five gear. Okay. So light chain mail. That's the chest. The belt. The boots. The leggings. The bracers. And the gloves. For the alliance. Now let's see how... Get out of the way. I want to see how sexy I become. Ah, it's more or less the same. Yeah, it was just the gloves that were slightly uh, thicker here. Requires level 5 light mail. Light mail. Okay, so we're in level 5 gear. I guess we can, uh... uh I might have to send those to an alt. I don't know. I don't know if I want to... Yeah, this is old school. <laughs> I think I'm gonna end the video in a minute. And then I'll do like another part or something. I don't know where else or what what else we could do. Yeah, no one wants to watch me do this. Back in classic, my troll shaman. That was a bad troll shaman. Yeah, anyhow, there's nothing I can do anymore. 40 minutes. You got to see some gameplay. Mainly the Fargo Deep Mine. I think the next one I'm gonna go to Stormwind, but I think I want to do that like a separate video. But yeah, so if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't like the video, give it a thumbs down. I'll make sure when you go in the Fargo Deep Mine, uh, you're trapped. It caves in, and then you end up in Molten Core, and Ragnaros uh, kicks your ass. And then you got to delete your character and make another one if you want to keep playing. So, uh, yeah. And if you want to subscribe to the channel, that'd be great. And if not, thanks for stopping by anyways. Take care, boys and girls. And I shall see you all in the next video. Bye now.